we are going to talk about hell. Oh, yeah, so hell. Hell. Yeah, this might be the only nice sermon that anyone ever remembers. If you have to talk about hell one time, <laughs> everyone's going to talk about that. Once you are in hell, you cannot escape. You live forever in horrible pain, in burning agony. Man. All sinners are there in misery, dying He's really getting after over over that, that hell sermon. Then woe is thou. Past the dinosaurs all the way down. So hell is a place, you know, hell is below the earth, and according to this sort of, <laughs> this sort of interpretation. <laughs> Blue House Sunday. You're always talking about hell and how you're burning and God wants to send you there and he's looking for an excuse. Uh, the re reality of hell, um, you know, even though we saw the Luau hell there, which is that's actually pretty funny, uh, is that it's, it's, it's choosing to reject love. And, and uh, we know that just from our own experience, that we can reject love, we can choose to live in loneliness, we can choose to live in isolation, how painful that is, not only for us, but for others. And that's really what hell is, too, is that God takes our choices seriously, and he's not going to force you to live in love, he's not going to force you to live um, with him in heaven. And so why, why are we talking about hell as being a burning place, or a cold place, or an empty place? All those images that we use are describing what it's like to, to live apart from the source of love, which is God. So, so uh, being with God is heaven, and choosing to reject God is hell.